What is going on everyone? Leon checking in and we're at it again with another video and it's time to talk more about Nova Launcher Prime 7 and specifically how to enable auto rotate. Now this is important because this feature further enhances your device's ability to auto rotate on different screens. Now when it comes to the Nova Launcher app, the goal is to make a list of tutorials starting from the basics and diving deeper into the app since it's so feature rich. As for this video, it's featured on the Nova Launcher Prime 7 playlist so you can find information related to this topic quickly and easily. All things said, let's go ahead and get into it. So let's start by opening the Nova settings. Now there's an important thing to mention here. If you opted for Nova Launcher Prime as I did, you can see that we have a Nova Launcher Prime app icon as well. You don't wanna tap on this because this just brings you to the app info. You actually wanna tap on the Nova settings app icon. So here we are at the home page of the Nova Launcher Prime 7 app, Nova settings. You can see that we have a long list of items here and within each item is another list. So you get an idea of how feature rich this app is. Now again, we're looking to enable auto rotate. So we're going to look for the item look and fill and tap on that. And I'm going to move my camera here so you can get a better view of the item that we actually want to tap on. You can see that we have screen orientation and to the far right on the other side, we have an option called auto rotate. I already enabled it since I've been using the app, but if you're looking to do this for the first time, you want to tap on that item. It brings up a drop down menu and normally default is the default option. So you'd want to tap on auto rotate. So that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it and found it useful, please leave a like. If you're watching on YouTube and have any questions or comments, as always drop those down below and I'll do my best to answer them. Now there are three ways you can support the content. The first way is to click on the Amazon storefront link in the description below. There you'll find items that I have bought or would buy and anything you buy from the storefront does support the content. The next way to show your support is just by sharing this video with someone who might enjoy it or find it useful. And the last way you can show your support is just by clicking the subscribe button. Now liking and subscribing are important because those are ways to vote on whether you like the content. Liking and subscribing are also important for new viewers and listeners. If new viewers and listeners see likes and subscribers, they're going to think that the content is helpful, worth watching and listening to. As always, thanks for watching and may the universe flow in your favor. And until next time, Leon, check in out.